It seems patch 6 is coming soon to Baldur's Gate 3. So in this video we're going over how we can see this, what we can expect from it, as well as when it could release. And if you want to stay up to date with more Baldur's Gate 3 news, feel free to subscribe. Alright, so if we take a look over at SteamDB, a website that shows the backend from Steam, we can see Larian is currently working on patch 6, with the title of the change list being release underscore patch 6. And we can see this title several times when we scroll down. So this means it could be coming soon. Sometimes it releases quite fast when we see this, but other times it can take a couple of months. But since patch 5 came out at the end of November last year, we can assume it could be coming in the upcoming 2 months or so. Ok, but now the real question. What could Larian be cooking with this patch? Well, some of you may know there is a deleted tweet about the next patch for Baldur's Gate 3 from a dev. And I have this beautiful low res picture that someone sent me, and it says the following. We're working on something incredible for Baldur's Gate 3, and I need to be annoying and I can't talk about it yet but oh my god, oh my god. And then as you can see below, another dev that is being excited for the next patch as well. But what could be so exciting that it hypes up the devs? Well, do take it with a grain of salt, because it doesn't have to be anything major, because some people may be really enthusiastic about a smaller feature. For example, we know that Larian confirmed a photo mode is coming later down the line for the game. And I've seen a ton of people being excited for it as well. So I think it could be coming this patch, but again nothing has been confirmed yet. But since we know it's coming and it took some sweet time, I think we're going to see it here. But other people do think it's something major and thought the dev was talking about DLC. Well, with being so excited. And of course that could be the case as well, but maybe the tweet was deleted to not set big expectations. Or maybe it is too much. Well, we can speculate, but we know Larian knows many people are excitedly waiting for a DLC. But then again, Larian also likes to move on to their next project. For example, Sven Vinke, the director of the game, is already working on it and he said the following about it. Been a great morning. After 4 months of rewriting and rewriting and abandoning ideas and then revisiting them, I finally figured out what act on on this thing I've been working on needs to be. Quote me when it's revealed to see how much of today's draft survives, I suspect a lot. One thing I learned over the years is that work done on abandoned drafts is never wasted, even if you think the drafts are shit. More than often, you'll find you can recycle your work once you find the right story for it. This type of work can be really frustrating when you're stuck, but the important bit is to never give up and remain self-critical, even if the situation looks hopeless. Smiley face. Creative work is the exploration of a vast search page and it can take time to find the right path. At least that's what I tell myself when I feel a failure after people have been nagging at me for months. Where's the f***ing narrative fan? That said, I haven't shared it with anyone yet, so it may be they all think it's bad and then I'll just kill this rat, go sit in a corner with my dog and pretend none of this happened. And press Ctrl Enter and start all over again. But I think I really like this one. Also, it's not what you think and it's not a teaser for an announcement. Just I'm generally excited about where this is going and wanted to share some of my excitement. It'll be quite some time before we can talk about this. And then last but not least, someone asked Goatee 2029, where Sfer replied with I was going to say very funny, but then I counted on my fingers. Smiley face again. So, it could very well be that Larian's next game is releasing in 2029. And I mean, it makes sense, right? Baldur's Gate 3 took 6 years to develop, and since it released in 2023, counting another 6 years on top of it, well, then we land on 2029. And Sven already confirmed that Divinity Original Sin 3 is coming sometime. We don't know if it's this game he's talking about, but we know it's coming eventually. More on this in this video that I made, so watch it after this one. Anyway, now let's go back to Baldur's Gate 3 and the DLC situation. So if you're asking for my opinion, since they're working on the next game already, I don't think a big expansion is coming to Baldur's Gate 3. Maybe some free smaller DLC, similar to what they did to their previous game Divinity Original Sin 2, but I think most devs are working on their next game. But at least we know they're working on the next patch as well. So what patch 6 could have in store is a photo mode, tons of bug fixes, some increase in performance, maybe some free smaller DLC like new character customizations, but there haven't been any major teasers besides the tweets I've shown you. Or there have been but I haven't seen them yet. So all we really know is that they're working on it, as we see in SteamDB as well, and that it could be coming soon-ish. But what do you think we're going to see in the next patch? Or at least what do you hope to see? 
Do share it in the comments down below because I do read them all. Oh, and while waiting for the next patch, maybe you could play my stupid RPG that I made. It's totally free and it's about a group of friends that have to find a magical artifact to save a kingdom. It's an old school pixel turn based RPG and it's around 3 or 4 hours long. So if you want to check it out, link in the description and the pinned comment. Anyway, thank you all for watching and I will see you next time.